Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 31st of August 1920, the world's first radio news program was broadcast on the station 8MK in Detroit, Michigan. 8MK had been established by the Scripps family, owners of the Detroit News, as the Detroit News radio phone service. William E. Scripps worked in collaboration with local radio pioneer Thomas Clark to prepare a successful proposal for the board of directors, fuelled by the desire to ensure potential competitors couldn't disrupt their news dominance in the city. Having leased a DeForest OT-10 radio transmitter that operated under an amateur radio licence, the equipment was installed with little fanfare. Even the station's licence was in the name of a teenage radio amateur for fear of undermining the Detroit News' reputation if the project turned out to be a failure. Nevertheless, a room on the second floor of the news building was given over to the station, and test broadcasts began on the 20th of August. A tall antenna was installed on the roof, and after ten nights of testing, during which the station exclusively broadcast music, it was decided to publicise the new service. On the 31st of August 1920, the front page of the Detroit News announced the nightly broadcast of the Detroit News radio phone service. That evening, at ten minutes past eight, 8MK broadcast the returns from one of Michigan's primary elections that had taken place that day, firmly establishing it as the world's first radio news programme. The four-hour broadcast also included sections of live music and the playback of phonograph records. Malcolm Bingay, the newspaper's managing director and the station's first master of ceremonies, later recalled how the public loved the station, but that city theatres and sports clubs initially refused to be involved for fear that the radio might have a detrimental effect on live attendance numbers.